Hello and welcome to my channel. This is the second part for creating calculator in Angular. First we will need to, we will modify our template for input which will hold the result and all entered characters and numbers. We will need to add here value and this value will be the sum result which will declare the variable for result in our component then we will need add clicking events to our buttons so on click call the method add to expression and pass the long button value the same we will add to our other buttons just pass button value here then in our component we actually need result which is a string and start with empty string don't have here anything yet then we'll have private variables for previous value and current value string and empty for current value as well string and empty then we will have the method add to expression My parameter value which is a string and this add to expression method will actually do all math. So we start with storing our previous and current values so if didn't didn't do anything yet we don't need to store anything in previous and current but if we already have something entered we will update our previous value Is current and current will be value. Then, if you will check if we need 
clear all. In this case, we'll make a result is empty string again. If we have cleared the last, which is volume C. So in this case, you also check if we check if um, the previous value wasn't equal sign then we will update this result with removing the last character otherwise we don't do anything and we'll check for cosine In this case, we will evaluate our result with using eval function and pass this result to it. So, our result will be calculated. Otherwise, else we just update a result with adding the value at the end of string. And it's safe. go to browser and see if it works one plus two equal three clear one divided by three equal three enter something else clear and that's it now we have working calculator Thanks for watching and leave your comments in the comment area and like if it, this video was helpful. See you in my next one. Bye.